Good morning, everybody. Um, got a surprise for you all. IXL Math has just released a new app as of yesterday, and I am going to show you the, for the app for the first time. Um, just like I'm seeing it for the first time. I haven't even opened it yet, um, but I went ahead and downloaded it as soon as I saw the alert for it this morning. As you know, IXL Math has been around for a very long time, and they have some of the best um, math worksheets and math practice and math help that you can find on the internet right now so if you can uh, go see IXL online right now that is a very good website to add to your bookmark so we're gonna go ahead and open up this app and see what it has to offer okay um, I don't have a username so I'm gonna continue as a guest Okay, so as you can see, you can choose from levels preschool all the way up to sixth grade. Um, we're going to go easy. We're going to go with the preschool and see what they have to offer them. Uh, for preschoolers, they can practice shapes, counting, money, money for preschoolers, huh? Uh, comparing, classifying sizes, and positions. Those are pretty cool. Um, I'm going to go with the money just because that just caught my eye. So we can count pennies and nickels and dimes and quarters, and you get to keep score. So, um, how many problems you get to do for free uh, without an account, I don't know. Because I know online, I think you can only do like 20. So, I don't know if that still accounts, or not accounts, but if that still applies here on the app as well. If you can only do so much as a guest, which 9 times out of 10, that's going to be the case. If you don't have a subscription with them, um, I just can't say for sure. So, until we actually hear word from... Um, I excel to say how this works we're gonna have to assume that you there's a limit to how much you can actually do on the app itself um, but if you can get a subscription to I excel I would highly highly recommend it um, even try maybe doing a group buy if you have a homeschool co-op or a group of parents who really want to get in on this uh, website or this app I would definitely see about getting a subscription so as you can see right now I'm just kind of clicking there's a timer going on here but it's going up so I don't know how many problems I'm going to end up going through before this thing finally stops. But it keeps score, which what child doesn't like to see themselves get a score? See, here we go. We are going into a challenge zone. This is the same thing. So all it does, the thing with this one being that it's preschool is it's asking questions and the words. So you may have to actually work with your, well, you're going to have to work with your child on this one unless they're exceptionally well at reading because, um, these are actually questions that they have posted for preschoolers. I don't know <laughs> about this one, but hey, you know, if your child can do it, more power to you and them. So we're going to hit done because I don't want to sit here and go through 50 million questions. But in these settings, um, like I said, you have a guest account. You can also sign in if you have more than likely that's going to be your subscription that you have online. That's going to apply here. Um, you have an awards listing which I can't click for some reason and there's a search option which you can probably search particular games that you want to get to and I'm trying to get back out of here so there's our preschooler then the kindergartners they have a little bit more all the way up to vocabulary we've got data and graphs this is for kindergarten this would be like for first and second grade you would think so I shudder to see what's for second for, let's go to second grade it's a little bit more it's like with every uh, grade level it goes up a little bit but it seems to be like ahead of where you would typically be for that child at that moment so I would say if you have a child in kindergarten you're probably going to want to start with the pre-k and then work your way up to that kindergarten level because the way this is going it seems to be like a step ahead of that actually grade level um, so here we go this is sixth grade all the way up we got probability measurements mix operates now this is like you know extra practice you on the road somewhere and you know your children you want to make sure they're still getting something while you're out in the grocery store you can you know put them on this app so they can get some extra math practice while you guys are out hanging so there that this might be a good one to have in the repertoire oh we got algebra and everything I'm not even going to try to embarrass myself right now <laughs> so I'm not going to do this because it's too early in the morning to be trying to do algebra um, so yeah this looks like I would recommend this app this like I said it looks like math practice at its core here so this is one of those apps that you're going to want to definitely have on hand 
um, even just have it in your cloud so if you want to just download it real quick you've already got it um, but yeah definitely I would recommend this app so again this is IXL math practice just came out yesterday 9 16 2013 so go ahead and get it while it's still free